Hello my friends my name is Mohammad Navid and this lecture I am going to teach you remaining options in the object menu of Adobe Illustrator As you remember in the last lecture we learned expand expand appearance until create trim marks we learned in this lecture we we'll start from path so what is the work of path let's see in order to learn path we need to take the help of pen tool so as you can see there right now I have taken pen tool and what I do I will come here and I will just simply click click and click so as you can see that right now I have this definite object or you can say I have just two lines and what I do definitely these are different these lines are called path getting me in easy word we can understand that that th these lines are called path different this line and this line and what I do I with the help of a uh, selection tool I can definitely select this object so I have selected this this line so you can say object or anything and what I do, I will go in the object menu of Adobe Illustrator and then path and as you can see that right now I have all the options of path. The first option is join. Let's say if I want to join means if I if I see this definitely this is incomplete. No? If I take the help of uh, pen tool. So definitely with the help of pen tool definitely what I have done definitely this is incomplete. So in order to complete this what I do I will select this go in object menu and path and then join. Just simply join again and just say again. So I will select this all. Select this, go in path and then join. So as you can see that right now I have joined means now I have complete object. So let's say if you had incomplete object, so with the help of join you can get complete object. Get me? So this is a work of jo a join. And then we have average means let's say if you want to average both uh, width and height so definitely you can do means that equal it will means it will it will equal uh, bo both height and width then we outline stroke means that if you want to change the outline or some outline stroke something and then simplify means if I take that of simplify now and if I check the preview so if I say pre simplify so definitely I get line I get these dots and definitely these dots if as you can see that these dots are coming blue blue dots so th these dots are called uh, definitely uh, definite anchor getting me so if you want to get more anchor so definitely you can do so if I say that zero so as you can see that right now I have just one two three four and five dots but if I say hundred or uh, th hundred so you can see that right now I have so many dots so definitely if you want to get dots something like this so with the help of simplify you can get uh, then uh, we have uh, uh, anchor definitely anchor point definitely as I told you that definitely uh, this if I zoom a little bit so that you can see definitely these definitely these dots so definitely these dots are called definitely uh, anchor so if you want to add any anchor definitely you can do with the help of this getting me so definitely these definitely these options are basically for path getting me so if you want to join or anything definitely with the help of uh, this path if you come in path definitely uh, it will show you all the options so with the help of this option you can work with path then we have shape definitely if you want to convert to rectangle you can also do then we have very important option that is called pattern so what is the work of pattern uh, before I teach you pattern I won't tell you something about a brush tool or pen brush because as you know that if I take the help uh, pen brush now so if I come here and if I select any color so if I just simply click so you can see that right now I am getting color getting me so in the place of getting color if I want to get any picture so with the help of pattern I can get how I will see, tell you now so I will zoom out a little bit okay and then I will go in file and place or place sorry for file and place and in place definitely I can find any picture so I can select any picture so I will just simply click on this picture and click on place and click as you can see that right now I have definitely I have picture getting me so in order to get any picture outside of the uh, Adobe Illustrator uh, what we do we take the help of uh, Place, getting me so with the help of place we can get any picture if you want to learn more about place definitely you can watch my video in place getting so as you can see that right now I have this picture now or image so what I do I will uh, first select this and then I will go in object menu and then I have the option called pattern so in pattern I have the first option called make so if I click on make and then it will show me this option so definitely I will go again in make uh, uh, pattern and make so okay and see definitely I here I can give the name to my pattern so here I can say that sir Navid it can be in name okay if you are not getting don't teach about it okay and then when done just simply click on done and then if uh, in order to see your picture in pattern 
what we need to do uh, we need to come in swatches panel if you are not able to see your swatches panel so go in window menu and just simply click on swatches and then it will show you this this, this panel so in swatches panel we need to find our picture so here where is the picture where is the picture so okay so see definitely here is a, here is a picture getting me so in order to get this picture now first I will select this and I have delete this picture because we don't need this picture anymore and now if I will go in uh, the print brush uh, in, in, in the toolbox of Adobe Illustrator and I will take the help of paint brush tool and I will just simply click on it and then I will just move my cursor so as you can see that instead of getting color instead of getting color now what I am getting I am getting that picture getting so let's say if you have any picture if you have any image and if you want to get that uh, that, that, uh, that image when you uh, when you move your uh, definitely cursor uh, if you use uh, a cursor or if you take the help of paint brush or any uh, brush so if you want uh, your picture to come instead of color so with that pop pattern you can do getting me so this is the way to get a uh, picture instead of getting color getting me so I've se select this and did it and I, then I will go in object menu and then we have the option of blend so definitely as you know what is a work of blend means it will blend two objects so if you want to learn more about blend so you should uh, you can watch my video blend uh, uh, definitely we also have learned what is envelope so you can also watch my video uh, this uh, envelope we also have learned perspective, light pen, definitely image trace, and definitely text step. Definitely text step, I will teach you. And then, definitely uh, text step, I will teach you, or definitely clipping mask. We also have learned compound part, I'm going to teach you, and artboard. So, let me tell you something about artboard now. So, what is mean by artboard? If I just select this, so as you know, that in, 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 in the toolbox of Adobe Illustrator, now we have one tool that's called artboard. So, we have learned what is a work of artboard. Artboard means that this, definitely this, definitely. If I zoom out a little bit, it's definite this box or definite this page. In easy word, we can say that this is a page. Okay, this page. So this page. So a page we call uh, we call here an artboard. So if you if you have any work with this page, so what you need to do, you need to go in object menu and then artboard, and here it will show you. So definitely we have learned what is the work of artboard uh, in artboard tool uh, video. So you can watch my video on artboard and graph. Definitely we also learn graph. Definitely this def this graph definitely. So in this lecture, what is remaining? Uh, just compound path and uh, text step is remaining to teach you. So first we will learn text step. So what is the work of text step? Let's say if I have any text, definitely we are learning text step. So definitely we need to take the help of text tool. And uh, see, and this I will write something. So I will zoom in a little bit so that you can see. And I will take the help of text tool and see. So if it can be anything okay so right now I'm just saying FFF -F -F. so because I don't have anything so that's why okay so as you can see that right now I have this now let's say if you have any text and what I'm uh, what I'm doing I'm just taking uh, any object so I'm taking right now rectangle so simply click and drag or oh, control Z okay so as you can see that right now I have this now so what problem I have without text step see that if I just uh, if I just come closer to text te this text now so nothing is effect is getting me so it is coming in front of text means that this box or this rectangle is coming in front of text see but if I want to adjust if I want to make this uh, uh, th this text to adjust this uh, rectangle in order to do this what I need to do I need to first hold down shift select this both and then go in object menu and then simply click on text step and just simply click on make and just simply click on ok now if I just say or again because not done properly so I will first again uh, hold down shift click object and uh, text step and then make now see that now see that now uh, what uh, this text is doing that it is adjusting the cell see that if I'm coming closer see getting me so as you can see that right now uh, definitely this object is making place for cell for uh, in inside or definitely uh, with this text getting me so as I'm cl going closer 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 so see that this text is being changed getting me so this is the work of text step means that text is wrapping to any anything getting me so this is the work of text step last thing we have that is called compound part so what is the work of compound part let's see I will se select this all and delete and I will take rectangle 
or anything I can take but for this example I'm taking rectangle and again I will take a new rectangle so so see that I have this one and this one and I will change the color so that I can see and I will also change the color of this also, also. so see that right now I have three objects again mean this the first one and then other one so what I want I want to cut I want to cut this big object means this red rectangle according to according to shape of these two objects so how can I do first I will select this all with the help of sh shift first I will hold down shift and then I will click every object and then I will go in object menu and then compound part and then click on make so as you can see that right now I have definitely this object and definitely I have definitely the hole on this object why because I say to I say to uh, Adobe Illustrator that I want I want I, I want cut in, in inside of this object according to shape of these two objects so as you can see that right now I have this definitely hole or if I take the help of any other uh, uh, rectangle now so let me tell let me take another tool okay see so if I say okay so see that if I move this now see that is coming so basically what what this object has definitely this object has this getting me this hole getting me so definitely uh, with the help of this compound part what can I do if let's say in the place of this in the place of having uh, th uh, this rectangle I can also have a heart so if I want to get the cut if I want to get the cut uh, on this object according to the heart shape so with the help of compound part I can also do get him so this was a lecture on remaining options in the object menu of Adobe Illustrator I hope you have understood for more videos lecture and exercises come to my website www.navithplace.com I love you and I will meet you in the next lesson. till then Allah